Right, hello everybody and welcome to the worst lit kitchen in the world and I just wanted to do a, a quick video and just show you how I'm going to make some photos for Instagram today. Um, it's not very scientific but I just thought I might just show you some of my, my setup starting with rather elaborate sort of setup here it means that I can stand underneath the camera to lay my stuff out for the photo and um, I'm just going to show you what I've got here and then um, I'll, hopefully I'll show you the photo at the end. Today I thought I'd do a photo for Instagram of the uh, Casio CA53W and as it's a black item I thought what I'd do is get a whole bunch of kind of black bits and pieces and gadgets to uh, to create a photo really so um, obviously I've got a bit of, a bit of a bit of tech, you know, some, um, you know, a torch and a multi-tool, another little sort of multi-tool. Um, I've got a little black sort of purse wallet thing here. And then this is actually the lens cap off my camera, which is up there. So, I mean, what I'm going to start off with is just popping these down on the counter and then just trying to figure out lining it up with the camera uh, where everything needs to be to make sure it's all in the frame. So I'm going to start with kind of like the two biggest items really, which is the, the, the notepad and the watch itself, just to get, just to get it lined up. So as you can see up here, I'm just lining it up on the kitchen surface to make sure that I have got everything in the frame from, from here up to the top. And uh, hopefully um, we'll get a nice sort of flat lay photo in a second. With these kind of things, I just like to, to balance them out. So, so all the time that I'm lining stuff down up on the counter here, I'm just checking that it's in frame on the top. I mean, I could probably draw a square or lay, lay something out to give me some boundaries, but... So flat lay photos are all about creating some kind of geometrical pattern really um, just making sure that everything's laid out neatly uh, in nice straight lines usually is the best way I find So hopefully you can see this here. I'm going to focus on the watch in the middle. I've got this all on auto, by the way. I've not made a big fuss here. And then I've got it set on a two second timer so I get no wobble from the camera. And there's my picture. So now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to download that, head off to Lightroom, just add a few little tints and bits and pieces and hopefully show you something that you will also find on Instagram later as well. Basically, it. I mean, I, I just wasn't really very clever, but I just wanted to, to show you some of the lengths that some people go through to take some photos for uh, Instagram, and I'm by no means doing uh, a huge amount here. In fact, I haven't even taken a sip of my cup of tea yet, and it hasn't gone cold, so... I'll put a link to my Instagram account. Give this photo a like, um, leave a comment. Go follow me on Instagram, that'd be great, and I will see you in another one real soon.